Traumas living in there is is addiction. Addiction, there's a group of cells in here called the insular cortex, and that's where craving is, and that's a part of the limbic system of the left hemisphere. And if you wipe out craving, do you still have an addiction? So this is, so, so it, let me just keep going. So we have these two emotional systems, and then we have these two thinking systems. And the thinking system is what distinguish us as humans from all of their mammals. Okay, so our mammals, our dogs love us. There ain't any question about that. Our dogs can punish us when we're not very, you know, we, we don't show up and we've sent them to doggy care if they're not happy about that. So mammals have other forms, but we have this higher executive functioning. And in the right hemisphere, it's right here right now. And in the left hemisphere, it's all about me because in there, in that thinking is my ego center in that prefrontal region. I, me, I exist. Hit back here, orientation association area, I begin and I end here. This is the package of me, the individual. I have a language. I can create language. I can understand language. I can read. I can write. I have mathematics in there. And this motor system controls the opposite side of my body. So that's a personality. To summarize them, what are the four types? Okay. So I, when I look at a brain, and this is totally randomly named, Um, And I did that because I had to communicate about it somewhere. So I call left thinking character one. And I actually give that part of my brain a name. I call her Helen. Hell on wheels, she gets it done. You're talking to Helen right now. She's giving you facts and details. She is all about what is right and wrong and good and bad. How do I fit myself into a society? How do I use my words in order to communicate? So this is the part of us that goes to work. It's our A-type personality. Character one, left thinking.